Hey guys, today I just want to show you a quick way to make some gymnastics grips with our Clash of the Fittest com competition coming up this weekend on Saturday. This is something that a friend of mine showed me for my first CrossFit competition, so I think it's really helpful to prevent any rips, but it also gives you a nice strong grip um, as opposed to using any external grips like pads or something like that to protect your hands. These are nice and thin, so you can get a good strong grip on the bar and you won't tear your hands, hopefully. So, I got Tony gonna help me out. He's gonna be our, our uh, hand demo for today. So all you need is a roll of tape and a pair of scissors, okay? You're gonna take the roll of tape, take a piece off, and you're just gonna measure from about halfway down the forearm to about halfway down the forearm on the other side. You can have that person make a fist, mark that off, and go ahead and rip it across there, okay? And then once you have one strip, it's a lot easier. You're gonna just make eight strips of equal length. And I like to use a counter like that so you can stick it on top and then just hang it off the side. Okay, once you have eight strips, you're gonna lay it sticky side up. And you're gonna take the other side and go sticky side down. So you're gonna go the two sticky sides together. Okay, and just lay it out, and once you do, you should have one strip that has a good thickness to it, and it's smooth on both sides. So after you've folded it together, you want to, you want to take the scissors and cut a little hole right at the top of your strip. Okay, just like if you've ever made snowflakes as a kid. Okay, and then when you open it up, you're going to have your four strips. Okay, that's the eight strips stuck together. And you got four strips with a hole in each one. Once you're ready to go ahead and put on your grips, you can do that first part in advance. Okay, you're going to put one strip over your middle finger, the other strip right over your ring finger. Okay, and then just make sure it sits nice and flat. And then you're going to have that person pinch it on their wrist and then they're going to move their wrist back and forth. What, that, what they're doing is they're trying to get that range of motion so it doesn't limit the range of motion. They want to get the full range of motion and wiggle out any slack. All right? So there will be a little slack and then with the partner you're just going to tape maintaining that slack. Okay, Just tape their wrists as you normally would. Once you get one or two layers you're going to fold the tape up on both sides this is to make sure it doesn't slip, and then you're gonna tape one or two more times on the wrist, okay? And then if you don't like this extra slack here, you can just go ahead and take the scissors and cut off the extra slack, okay? And then these strips, once you're done with that workout, you can reuse them. Typically get one or two good days of competition out of them, and then you just throw away the wrist uh, tape each and every workout. And that's it. Save your hands.